Hey guys, are you ready to go on another day trip with us? Today we're going to Mount Takao to try out their famous soba. Shinji, we're gonna go to hiking. That's the whole purpose of going to mountain. Fresh air, we finally arrived. You know, I remember coming here a very long time ago, and I remember the hike to be really difficult for me. Let's eat soba first. So here we are, Momijiya Honten. The cacao is very famous for Tororo Mountain Yam Soba. Mine is Tororo and Nameko. Nameko Mushroom Soba. This one, white stuff is grated mountain yam. Love this mountain yam. Yamakimasu. This slimy texture is the mountain yam. It's the very good for your health. And this is nameko mushroom. Nameko mushroom is also slimy mushroom. It's a slimy combination. Itadakimasu. Mm. Oishi. I got the tempura tororo soba. This is tororo, which is mountain yam. And it's really delicious. Um, the texture is slimy, just like natto, you know, Japanese people love slimy textures. We're gonna break this quail egg into that mountain yam. Itadakimasu. Mm. Mm. That's a pretty sizable shrimp. Oh, it's delicious. I know you guys are big fans of Naruto. This is basically fish cake. This is like a whole mixture of mountain vegetables with some of that Nameko mushroom or Warabi Kogomi. Those are types of um, uh, mountain vegetables. Mm. Mm. It's really nice. I love mountain vegetables. Mountain vegetables sounds like really delicious and nutritious so this is cookie wasabi this is pretty rare and this is the stem of the wasabi plant i've never had this before crunchy and you get like an aroma of wasabi and that kick from wasabi this is simmered in like a sweet soy sauce wow this last one right here is called yama kurage basically that means mountain jellyfish yeah, yeah, crunchy. This one is like marinated in a lighter soy sauce and with sesame seeds. Mmm, mmm, that crunch is really nice. Mmm, mmm, I like it. All right, of course we have to get some dessert. This is the soba pudding. Yes, soba pudding. They actually use soba in this dessert. Uh, let's check it out. Mmm, look at that. Oh, I love that jiggly. Whoa, soba. I didn't expect that because I was expecting sweet dessert. The aroma is soba, but the taste is milk. The sweetness mostly comes from that syrup, that kuromitsu. It's very light, refreshing, cold, delicious. Okay, now that we're filled up, I'm ready for anything. Let's go hiking. Naturally, we got sidetracked. Now they are selling some Mount Takao cookies, so we had to get a pack. Right next door, this man was making fresh rice crackers. Oh, 
We couldn't resist. They were making fresh rice crackers in front of us. This one is a fresh rice cracker sesame seed. Mmm. 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 Nice and crispy. Mmm. Really good. Okay. Now we're really gonna climb the mountain. so quiet and peaceful today. You know, the last time I came here, the only thing I remember are the huge crowds because we came on the weekend on a major holiday. But today there's hardly any people on the trails and this is really nice. This trail is pretty steep, look at that. It's gonna zigzag up there. I know this is a steep trail but I don't remember it being this steep. Are we halfway there? Not yet. Damn. There are so many resting places along this hiking route. Thank God. Did you know Mount Takao is the most popular mountain to hike? I didn't know that and I don't see why it's so popular. All it is, is a lot of work. Okay, so we're halfway up the mountain. What do you do if you don't have water and you are dying of thirst? No worries, you're still in Tokyo. Check out all these vending machines. If the weather is nice, this is a great view of Tokyo. So we're halfway up the mountain and thank God we have food. So we're here at this place called Tenguya and they are famous for their cheese tarts. And we got two today. One is the regular cheese tart and the other one is a cold version. And you know, I feel like we deserve some more food because all those carbs that we had at lunch, they're gone, they're burned off. I'm gonna try the one at room temperature. This is a room temperature cheese tart. Let me break this in half for you guys. Ooh, look at that. Oh my God, that looks so good. Look how creamy it is on the inside. Whoa, that is cheesy. Oh my God. Mm. The texture of the tart and the texture of the cheese part is so completely different. It doesn't taste anything like a New York cheesecake or anything like that. It's more like a cheesy tart. That, that's the only way I can describe it. It's not that sweet. It's really well balanced. Um, I personally like it a lot. This is the cold cheese tart. Let's break this one apart. Ooh, it's cold. Ooh. Yeah. Okay, the texture is different on this one. Mm, because it's cold? Yeah, mm -hmm. it's totally different. Mm. 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 This is the room temperature one. It's very creamy. And this is the cold one. It's not as creamy. Texture is totally different. So, which one do you like better? You know what? I like the room temperature one better. I, I like that, that the difference in texture. I, I like the contrast between the creamy, smooth interior and that flaky crust. I, I, I really like that difference. I really do. I like cold one better. Okay guys, it's not so steep anymore so I can finally talk to you guys. A um, little bit of information about this place. Mount Takao has been a sacred mountain for over 1,000 years. And right now we're walking towards the temple, uh, which many people go to, to pray to the Tengu God for good fortune. Okay guys, we're at the entrance of the temple and there are two ways to get there. We can go up this long flight of stairs or we can take this other route where everyone's, I mean everyone else is taking this other route. Hmm.
Yeah, we made it to the top, guys. And you know what? Climbing those steps, that's good exercise. That's a good workout for the gluteus maximus. We're still not at the summit. We have 20 more minutes to go. <sighs> okay, here I am, breathless again. Breathless, once again. Now the cool thing about this hike, Mount Takao, is that there are a lot of cultural, historical properties along the way, which makes it rather interesting. Let me catch my breath. Almost there. Almost there. Almost there. Almost there. Almost there. Yes, yes. Here is the top of Takao-san. If the weather is nice, you can see Mount Fuji over there. But today, unfortunately, we can't see. Sorry. So here is the top of the Mount Takao. It's all surrounded by nature. And vending machines. You know what I like about this place? It's actually very accessible to people living in Tokyo. In fact, this is located inside of Tokyo. We're still in Tokyo, just not the metropolitan area. So this is the most popular mountain for hiking. We've chosen the main trail, the trail that most people use, but there are other trails if you are more energetic or you are more of an experienced hiker. There are amenities all over the place. There are toilets, there are vending machines, shops, restaurants, you name it. Although you're in nature, you still have the conveniences of the city. Now, instead of walking all the way back down, we're gonna be taking that cable car. Okay, Satoshi, that was a really great day. Yeah. yeah. You know, despite the cloudy weather and the fact that we didn't get to see Mount Fuji, that didn't really matter. The soba was delicious, that cheesecake was amazing, and I love that cable car ride mm -hmm. down. Mm -hmm. That was so much fun. That was like riding a roller coaster without the speed. Thanks for watching, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up, share this video with your friends, subscribe. You know what to do. See you next time. Bye. Bye.